Oh, so I'm entering Perini camp here. Hello, sir. How are you? Fine, thank you. Welcome. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I see already there's a water hole there. That's on here. Mm, nice. Yeah, oh, a beautiful view of the animals. Yep. Oh, oh look at that. Sleeping in a tented camp here in Perini, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. One with nature, for sure. Oh. Hello, you could have said hi. So here at the Perini Rhino Camp, they also have this hideout. Rhino Camp, yes and you can go inside correct and then you have and you're welcome. oh wow it's like a bar <laughs> oh shit i should have been you like i can get you a drink here <laughs> i should have it should have had a, been a bit more um silent i'm sorry i was too excited animals so i scared them away but yeah this is a great this is a great way to see the to see the wildlife huh, from a different perspective. Yes, it is. And then you people can guests come come here all the time. Oh yeah, all the time. Only at, at night is the time you cannot come over here. Yeah, of course. Yeah, maybe in future we might uh, think of putting a spotlight. <laughs> oh yeah, a floodlight. Yeah, yes. that would be great. Yeah. Wow, that's ex that's really cool. I didn't need to wait for. Oh, it's just the three of us. It's John here. Just the three of us. Hey, Johnny. Hey. How are you, man? I'm good. Wow, nice vehicle. Oh, oh you even have power sockets in here? Yeah, yeah, you have the power sockets. You can charge whatever you need to charge. No, I'm good. I'm good. I think I feel like a king already, like this. <laughs> did it. <laughs> How do you say good luck? You don't know? How about is good luck in Swahili? What is it? Tell me, guys. Good luck is like. Um... <laughs> You don't know either. No, no, we know. Nakuta kia mema. Nakuta kia mema. Yeah. Ah, nakuta kia mema. Yeah. Ah, nakuta kia mema. There we go. Nakuta kia mema. Because I saw a lot of things already. I saw leopard and lions and like all the big fire and stuff. I said to the guys, I haven't seen cheetahs. And they were like, oh, this is a playground for cheetahs because it's like wide open spaces. And as you can, uh, as you maybe know, cheetahs are the most, the fastest land animal. And they reach up to like 70 kilometers an hour, if I'm not mistaken. Am I right? Something like that, huh? Uh, so yeah, this is where they are in their advantage on this great plain. He's just looking if he can see them. But of course, it's very hard to find cheetahs. If you don't try, you don't know. <laughs>
getting tied up. <laughs> oh, I'm the white Maasai. <laughs> Black Maasai. <laughs> Black Maasai. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Oh, here we are. Um, yeah, they said, what do you want for a sundowner? I say, yeah, okay. I get another beer today uh, at the highest point here, right? Of the Opechetta Conservancy. So, yeah, uh, there is where we all went game driving. There is the big plane where we tried to find cheetahs we were unlucky we saw a really cool eagle but that was too far to show you guys with the phone uh, yeah it has been uh, a great ride and learning a lot from these guys so yeah it's a great way to end the day here up on the little hill up call and they serve me coffee and hot water and waking up oh with a view like this hey buddies oh they got scared of me I guess Good morning. It's just after six. And the guys yesterday asked me here in the, at Perini, um, so you want to go on safari tomorrow? And I'm like, is that a question? I'm like, yeah, I'm in the bush bush for a reason. And if I can go on safari, I want to do it as many times as possible. So vehicles ready, I guess. some poles yeah in the corridor yeah that was just to make sure that the, the rhinos will not be able to go out but other animals can walk out elephants also the elephants also because elephants have long legs so they can jump off and then pass these poles on the other side is a safari there's a barrier yeah so just in case a rhino managed to get out of these poles yeah uh, its belly will touch on, on the on the rocks on the other side uh, since they have shorter legs you yeah. haven't been really lucky yet this morning uh, but one thing that is cool to show you is an animal corridor. We got to one of them. There are a few around in the park. It's basically made for animals to have their natural migration. And as you can see uh, here, the animals can literally just cross into another area. And there's another conservation on the other side of the road. Uh, and there are camera traps uh, there, there and there and someone comes in and cleans this area so they can see basically who go, comes and goes <coughs> by footsteps and stuff and it's pretty cool to know that animals are actually can move freely outside of the this is a family of jackals and it's funny jackals are monogamists they have one partner for life so seeing five of them together basically means that's a little family with three young ones. And how long do the young ones stay with the with their parents? Um, a Just a couple months and then they go by themselves.
two males. And they're, they're super close. Yeah. And they don't really seem to care either. That we hear. Something pretty cool here about the Perini Cam is that it made it completely sustainable. Uh, so there's like, for example, no concrete. It's kind of leave no trace. They can pick up the cam and go. And also like, this is the shower. So it's a bucket of hot water with 20 liter and that's it. So it's about five minutes, six minutes of nice and, 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 and warm water for a quick shower. Uh, it's there, it's getting cold, so I gotta run <laughs> and get my shower. Time to move on, unfortunately. I will miss this uh, little cute place. Um, they only have eight tents, by the way. Yeah, and, the, and the coolest thing is, at night, you can hear the animals roaming around. So when you get to a room, you get a private guy bring you back to your tent because buffaloes were here last night. They just come here and uh, when you're in your tent you can actually hear them roaming around it's kind of like exciting I didn't sleep that well because <laughs> I was too much concentrating on uh, the sounds around me it was pretty nice <laughs> 